Sorcerer Box team does a thousand things. Uh, one of the biggest things we try to do is expose kids, students, teachers um, to science subjects and we try and give a new appreciation and a new recognition to science subjects, uh, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Our team started in 1999, so that means this year in 2014 we are actually 15 years old, so it's really exciting for us. We've been participating in uh, regional and international competitions, um, and in particular last year we actually did so well that we got to go to the international championships in St. Louis, and there we were the best performing team from Virginia. Well, getting 55 kids from different counties working together into a coherent team can be a challenge. But basically what we try to do is we try to get everyone the ability to follow what they are really interested in. And we have mentors and alumni who always come in and help our team members learn and facilitate the cooperation and teamwork. He's always talking to the cat design folks and it's like this, this interchange. So today uh, we're smack dab in the middle of robotics build season so we have six weeks to make a highly competitive robot on an international scale. So basically we have the kids who are interested in engineering design and process. They are right now working with a CAD program which allows you to make 3D models of your robot and they're also discussing strategy and design. And then we also have kids who are more interested in the brick and grit of building stuff, and they're using wood and plywood to make goals, um, a model of the field, so we have something to work with and practice on. These kids learn a real world process, something we'd use in industry. You have a business plan, you have objectives, you have a limited timeline, you have a design process, and you have multiple teams that may have to work together and integrate different systems together under very short time constraints. A lot of pressure, sometimes even some tension that builds, but ultimately where the whole team feels good about the product that they get out. So first replicates what happens in industry very, very well. All 55 of our students, we don't get community service hours for what we do. We don't get personal rewards for what we do. It's really about coming together and achieving something as a team and as a group. And so we have alumni from like six years ago who come in to mentor the team because we've made such an impact on them. And we have professionals from our sponsors who come in and mentor and they don't get paid and the most they get is we give them dinner. But they are so passionate about the program and about the future of our team that they always invest time in us and we're eternally grateful for that. Yes, collaboration is a great idea. It's the best thing you can possibly do. <laughs>